right now you're into urban mix make sure you stay in tune with the best you're welcome to urban mix make sure you stay in tune the best you know prince always looking fresh looking clean today i have quay so one of the greatest guy here in the united states when it comes to afrobeat this guy got everything together today he is right here on the seat we're going to know what about tonight we, we just don't want to spill the bean but he says he got something for us for urban mix viewers we want to know what are your expectations first of all introduce yourself to the viewers watching us right here on urban mix i go by the name young k kway so and the claim and the tenor by the african entertainment tax force i practice my art and i hold the mic with respect because i have the ability to solve all issues simultaneously with my lyrical and physical swag ability simply sophisticated lyrically emancipated ogr man this this rhymes is a whole like a whole bars for some some sick tune we're gonna put some sick tune at the end of the day we want to know what are expectation tonight for the ghana music awards usa first of all i want to big up all the promoters the hulk dundee 2g's capito high life radio listen this is one of the best so far i've been to almost every single award show in america as far as Ghanaians are concerned i've been nominated awarded many times this is one of the best so i'm just so happy and highly elated to just be part of this and i have the privilege of being nominated for four awards so four categories gospel afro you know the rest I, I i don't even remember but you know it's it's all about putting the work and knowing that you deserve you know what you've been nominated for and as far as tonight i have the privilege of hitting the stage and and you know i'm gonna bring my youngest sugar daddy profile on stage so it's all about soothing and then we're going to take it up to a notch and then you know what i'm saying like i always said i don't sound clash i clash sound so you know it's up for you to gain that energy to face my performance man it's going down right here so if you're feeling the vibe that i'm feeling right here it's it's very i mean there's an air condition right here but i mean i'm already sweating because like the vibes that i'm getting from this quay so right here it's it's sick but we want to know, people always talk about Ghana music here in the United States. You've been here for a while. How do you see Ghana music? I mean, the musicians right here in the United States. How do you see them? How are they doing good? Are they doing good? Or, I mean, in terms of organization, performance, and songs? I'll go with songs. If I, I can write a whole book. And this right here would be the cover. All I'm going to say is it's going to take off. We're rolling up right now. The reason why I'm saying that, like, if we go back like five, ten years ago, the Ghanaian based artists here in America, I would be so honest, our materials wasn't even really up to par. Everybody was trying to do music, but right now the quality is there. Like the lyrical content, everything is up to par. From I got guys here that have songs that are supposed to be in rotation and every single Afrobeat on um, platform in the whole world including myself you see i'm not just an afrobeat artist i'm an afro dance hall artist but you know it's just so many cat categories but at the same time we we matching up right now because it seemed like they didn't give us that kind of platform or the respect that we deserve you have to go release a song in ghana to blow up before it can blow up here in america that thing needs to cease because our, our, our songs right now are, are as equally as good as the Ghanaian based artists. So once again, I'll big up the whole, you know, the Dundee, fan, everybody that's part of this, I'll big them up because this is, this is what we needed. This is the platform. And I've seen for the first time, they actually put in with the, us, the US based artists, you know, a little bit, in, in the front, where it's supposed to be, it's a U.S. Um, um, GMA USA. Why are we in the background? That's why people doesn't give us the, the respect that we deserve. But, you know, finally, listen, we're here. What, what, what do you think was the problem from initially that people were not giving you guys the forefront? Now, is it because, like, the, as you're saying, the kind of music you guys were doing was not up to the front? That's why they were not giving you the audience. What do you think was the, the, the difficulty? What was the problem then compared to now? What I'm trying to say is 
right now we've reached we know what what's quality we know if it's reggae it's reggae if it's dance all it's dance or if it's afrobeat it's afrobeat lyrical content everything is on point i'm not saying i'm going to put everybody in the basket and say everybody's good but what i've heard so far from almost everybody that got nominated we on point so djs please us based djs germany what have you ghanaian djs listen we are trying we too we are we are like we have to do something extraordinary in order to blow you know what i mean it's we need the DJs to push our songs. looking fresh looking clean and as I told you already we are right here on right here is a red carpet green carpet black carpet every carpet you can think of and we have this beautiful right right here she's going to introduce herself and after that we're going to have a chit chat first of all welcome to urban mix and the viewers all around the world want to know your name and what are you doing here tonight hi <laughs> my name is Stella Ada and uh, I'm one of the nominees. I've been nominated for the um, US-based Gospel Music of the Year and US-based Gospel Artist of the Year. So uh, that's why I'm here. <laughs> and I'm also uh, performing tonight. Being an Artist of the Year, nominees and all that, you've seen a lot of people already on the bill. What makes you think that you're going to win this award and you're going to take that award makes you different? What makes you different from all the nominees? Yes, you've been nominated, but what makes you different from others that you think you're going to win this award tonight? I believe I did enough to be able to put my music out there. It's called Jehovah My Ozi, means the Lord My Fortress, and it's been playing all over, and uh, I believe it deserves an award because it's a powerful song and very inspirational. When you hear it, you just like to go with the flow. Yeah, so I believe it's going to win an award today. She believes she's going to win an award today because it's blowing, it's having a good time. There's this question that I wanted to ask anybody that I want to talk to. Why is it that it's so difficult for either any of the artists here, whether gospel artists, hip life, hip hop, what is it so difficult for people doing music here in the United States to blow? Yeah, that's a very good question. Um, what I found out in this country, um, we struggle a lot and because um, we don't get the support that we need to be able to put our music out there. Back home in Ghana, it's our own country, so uh, there are ways and means to be able to maneuver to get 
into the system and have your music played. But here, we, we have to compete with those back in Ghana and those here in America, and it's really difficult uh, if you are not getting the support financially and, um, you know, in every way that you can possible. And sometimes you have to even take your music to Ghana and have them play it before it becomes a hit. And that too, it's, it's like a long process. But thanks be to internet and all that, these days we have social media that you can play your music and it will put it out there for you. Back in the days we used to, I, I did a um, Yes Year Champion back up many years ago. You had to take the cassette from place to place to get it played before you know, it becomes a hit. But thanks to God, now we have social media that we can play our music and other platforms that we can play our music for people to get to know. So uh, we didn't really get the support, but now I think with this um, awards going on, I think it's gonna open many doors for those of us that are doing music over here. The song you just mentioned just brought me back to remembering you. All right, I don't know how to sing the song well, but for viewers, they are thinking, mm, maybe I know this lady. Remember them with that song and let them know that you are the person speaking right. Okay, I'm actually going to sing it tonight, a little bit of it. So, um, Yesu Christo, Oye Champion, Bako Pe, Wajime Free, Miso Shenyi Namo, Semenshi Anwa, Anka Miye Deinye, Nyami Ba Yesu, Oye Champion, Bako Pe. Urban Mix. Make sure you stay in tune with the best.